Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. This is Guldeep here and uh, today we are going to learn that how we can perform the video recording in Playwright. Okay, so let's start. So friend, this is the code which I have generated with help of test generator in my previous video. And today we will see that how we can do the video recording for the same. Okay. So let's see like what this code is actually doing. So first it is launching this demo.nobcommerce.com. Okay. And then it is identifying the email and the password field. And after that it is entering some value inside these fields. And uh, in the last it is clicking on the login button. Okay. So if you go through the UI, this is the URL and it is clicking on this login button. Then it is trying to identify this email and the password field. After that, it is entering some value inside these fields and clicking on the login button. So let me quickly execute this code as well so that we can see like what is happening here. So I will simply right click and run a Java application. You can see like it has launched the URL and quickly entered the email and the password inside those fields. Okay. So now let's see like how we can capture the video for the same. So we need to make some changes here. Right in this way like new browser dot new context options. Okay. And after that we need to use one method that is the set record video directory. And uh, you can notice there are two other methods that is the set record video size. You can record the videos in the different size as well. But uh, to capture the video, we need to use this one that is the set record video DIR. Okay. And after that, we need to provide a path here paths dot get. Okay. And after that, location where we want to store our videos. So let me pass as the Play right videos okay that's it so what we need to do basically with the help of this browser dot new context options use this set record video dir method and then we need to set the path where we want to store our video files okay so this is the path which i have given that is the play right videos okay what this code actually do it it will basically create a folder inside this play right automation project and it will capture the videos inside the same. So let me quickly re execute this program. Okay. And see like is it generating the video or not. Okay. So I will simply right click and run a Java application. Okay. So here we can notice like it has quickly launched the URL and uh, enter the mail and the password. Okay. So now let's go to our project and simply right click and the refresh it. You can notice like it has generated one folder that is the playwright videos and this is our video file. So simply go to the properties. Okay. And here you can notice like it has captured the video. Just play it. Okay. So you can see like it has captured the video. Okay. It has showing all the things like it has launched the URL and after that it has entered the email and the password. Okay. So friend, this is the way you can capture the videos of your test cases and uh, it is helpful from the debugging point of view. So you can easily come to know like where are your test cases getting failed. Okay. So friend, that's it for today's video. I hope it is helpful. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Thank you so much.